Data and IT are at the heart of almost every business these days. Today, I'm in Ann Arbor, Michigan, at Domino's Pizza's headquarters, where I've been talking to Kevin Vasconi, the CIO of Domino's. Uh, Domino's has been adopting uh, the cloud uh, for, for multiple years. We have a huge internet presence. Um, our e-commerce site is, is one of the largest transaction sites um, uh, in the e-tail space. Um, and data is absolutely essential to everything we do. It's essential for us to understand our customer, it's for, essential for us to understand our offerings, uh, and we also do a lot of A-B testing. And Kevin, you run a fairly extensive uh, IT operation here, which includes developers who I think have built their own point of sale system. Yeah, no, absolutely. Um, Domino's feels it's a competitive advantage to have our own point of sale system. And I think we're one of the few um, QSR businesses that has a single common global point of sale system, which we build all of our other properties off of. We build our e-commerce solution off of it. We build our supply chain management system off of it. And from a deployment standpoint, we've got almost 10,000 stores now, and we've got our point of sale system deployed in about 7,500 of those stores. Um, and soon we'll be releasing um, our dual byte version of our point of sale system, which will open up the rest of Asia for us. Uh, with the goal to get 100% of our stores up and running on our point of sale system. How big is online to you and, and is it growing? Um, in the U.S. we run about 35% of our orders uh, online and uh, that translates into about a billion dollar business. Um, the European uh, markets, uh, the UK, uh, actually Japan, Korea, South Korea, um, in Australia are right now are over 50% online orders. And of those online then, Presumably some are coming from mobile devices. Growth is coming from, um, is more mobile devices. Right. And we have specific applications for the iPhone, for Android, and for the Kindle Fire. Of course, your big day is Super Bowl uh, Sunday, when I think your orders go through the roof. Tell me about how, as an IT guy in a, an organization driven by IT, how you prepare for that. It's, it's probably um, uh, our largest day, single sale day. Um, I think we sell... Um, 17 million slices of pizza, um, which is equivalent to like 1.2 million uh, pizzas. And from an IT standpoint, um, we've got to make sure that the stores are up and operational, um, that they can process credit cards, and that our internet site uh, is up and operational. Because one of the things that we've seen, uh, and one of the advantages we have, we can offer all, to all of our franchisees is, as the order volume goes up, you don't necessarily have to add people to answer the phone. You can direct them to the web. So the, the technology on the website scales very, very nicely, all right? And um, we don't have to staff for the peaks. Uh, but as an IT professional, what we have to do is we have to make sure all of that works. Uh, we have to make sure the connection to the store works. We have to make sure our internet site is up and operational. Um, so for the Super Bowl, uh, we actually create a war room. Uh, we've got developers in the room, we've got network engineers in the room, we've got storage guys in the room, uh, we've got systems administrators in the room. And literally, um, it'll, it's, a, it's a very large room and you, there's nothing but a sea of monitors. And we've instrumented the applications, we've instrumented the network, uh, we're watching the order counts come in, and it's almost as much fun as watching the Super Bowl. Yeah, it sounds, sounds fantastic. <laughs> sounds like almost an election event. You know, yeah, very similar. Yeah, yeah you, you watch the results swing come in. It and, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, now, I mean, so you mentioned online has been growing. I think some of the days you're actually, when you've done special offers online, you, you've almost, you've approached similar sorts of numbers. Yeah, as we continue to see online adoption go up, um, we, the, our marketing team uh, has been working very diligently to drive more business online. But um, one of the things, because Domino's is very much a data-driven company that we've, we've been able to do, is we'll actually A-B test offers, very similar to what a Google or an Amazon will do. So explain that. How does an A-B test work? Sure. So what, what you're able to do is you, you set up um, uh, two environments, or a, a, a one environment will have your offer on it, and the other environment will have you know, current state. Um, and then you start to redirect traffic um, to uh, the new offer and you test to see whether people, you know, do they click through the offer, right. do they, do they uh, go through with the transaction. Um, and in our business, because we drive so many transactions, we can actually do that very, very quickly uh, because you need a certain number um, to be statistically uh, significant. But for us, that's usually in a day. So we can run an A-B test um, with statistical results in a day and find out whether um, this marketing offer or uh, this positioning of a new navigation on the website 
um, is actually going to increase or decrease people's uh, propensity to buy. And so you can adjust your business almost in real time. Yeah, it, it's yeah. very close. Real time's a little too quick, but right. I mean, literally we're talking, you know, 24 hour kind of period right. uh, where we can do the analysis, we can figure out, is this a good offer? Is this gonna either drive customer satisfaction or the market basket or conversion? And uh, that's a very, very efficient system. Great, thank you very much indeed. Thank you.